Hi everyone, and welcome to today's video. Um, a lot of us are familiar with the Platinum Preppy. It's an affordable, um, just somewhat disposable fountain pen. It's great for gifting, it's great for uh, beginners, uh, and it's also really handy because uh, they seal really nicely and they can last on your desk, you can eyedropper them. So, you know, there's something in here for people at all levels of uh, this hobby. But it is a fairly basic disposable design. In the last couple of months, Platinum have come out with something that is a upgrade from this pen. And that is the Platinum Prefonte. Now, this is still basically the same uh, working mechanism of the Preppy. And I'll show that in more detail. But what they've done is they've created a more grown up body for the pen. So I'm going to do a quick little unboxing of this pen. Um, I've got a converter here, which I'm going to put in it, just a platinum converter. Um, I don't I don't like platinum blue black and this comes with a platinum blue black cartridge. So I'm going to put a converter in it, ink it up with something else, um, probably the new Twisby blue black. And then we'll have a look at uh, this pen. We'll have a look at it in comparison to the Preppy uh, and uh, see how it writes. So back in a second. Before I do that, I just want to show you the back of this packaging. It's quite interesting. So it's got one year no dry and shows a graph there of how uh, the ink evaporates with the cap, I suppose, um, which is an interesting sort of way of showing a comparison of a pen with their slip and seal mechanism here. Um, so it also says how to use, um, it shows you how to put the cartridge in, and then a few sort of like little extra notes about things like don't use for anything other than writing. Um, <laughs> ingestion of such as cap will cause suffocation and a few other bits and pieces so just an interesting little bit of packaging oh but this is the graphite blue version of the preppy the uh, profonte it comes with a number of different colors actually um but yes let's ink this up and uh let's see what it's all about well i've inked this up now with the new twisby blue black it comes in this very cool bottle so let's see what this pen uh, is actually all about so um nice little snap cap it's got a nice sort of feel. It is a plastic pen. Like we are talking about, you know, just a basic plastic pen. Price point, the, in Australia, this retails for about $17. Uh, in the US for around the $10 to $12 mark, depending on where you go, which is significantly more than uh, the Preppy, which in Australia retails for around $10. Uh, so, you know, it is an upgrade. It's got a nice, if we look at the two next to each other now, they're, you know, similar size, um, similar feel to the plastic, um, you know, but with this metal clip, without the plastic clip, there's much less branding on it. It's still got like, you know, platinum made in Japan and Profonte written there. Um, but if we look at them uncapped, we'll see that they're basically the same sort of size um, section and the same nib. Uh, and they're both platinum proprietary uh, converters or cartridges or I assume can still be eyedroppered just like the original Preppy. Um, the Preppy is a great pen because of how versatile it is and the fact that at that price point with a decent nib on it, you know, it's a really, really good option. Uh, and yet the Profonte is just, as I said, a slightly more grown up version with the metal clip and sort of more understated designs and some interesting sort of colours. I'm not sure how well this colour is being picked up in the in the camera, but it's a very sort of dark tealy blue i suppose you could say um it's got some really nice sort of color through it and um it's a it's a beautiful color actually but let's see how it writes because that's what fountain pens are designed to do so what we have here is the platinum now i'm going to say it straight up that is super super smooth this is a medium those are steel nibs, but but that writes so smoothly. That's super impressive. Laying down a nice little patch of ink. As I said, the ink here is Twisby blue black, which is a nice sort of dusty blue black. It's not terribly dark. It's got some nice sort of shading in there. It's almost got a sort of a gray sort of feel to it um 
but this writes really, really well at this price point and looking like this, if it had a, like, gosh, if it had a screw cap, I think I'd be in heaven. Um, the cartridges and converters are proprietary, so, you know, you're not going to be able to just chuck anything in there, but you can get that little platinum converter um, adapter thing, which you put in and then you can use a standard international um, uh, cartridge, uh, which is handy. Um, I happen to have just a platinum converter here, so I put it in this pen. Um, but gosh, this is actually really impressive. So I think at this price point, like just in terms of size, like here it is alongside a like a Lamy Safari. So it's not a small pen. Um, it's light. It's probably on par with the Lamy Safari in terms of weight. Um, so it's not a huge pen. It's not going to sort of, it's not a statement pen. It is super affordable. And you know what? It writes really, really well. I'm so, so impressed with that. Um, like that's with no pressure whatsoever. Like that's, that's doing the writing itself. Like, Yeah, very impressed with that. Very happy. So, Platinum Prefonte, the new sort of budget line pen that fits between the Preppy and something like the Plaisir. Um, the grown-up Preppy, really. Um, I'm really impressed. Hope you found this video interesting and useful. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to this channel. Uh, hit the notifications button if you want to stay up to date with the videos that I produce. Please feel free to get in touch using any of the platforms listed below. You can find me on Instagram or Twitter at the underscore offstage underscore me, or you can contact me on any of my videos here, uh, or drop me uh, an email which is listed down below. Uh, if there's a way I'd like to support the channel, or if there's a product you think I should be looking at, get in touch and let's see what we can do. In the meantime, enjoy your pens, enjoy writing, and I'll talk to you later.